Hey YouTube, it's ICU. Today I wanted to talk about some updates in Cydia. Those of you who have been anxiously awaiting the arrival of Winterboard for iOS 7 and A7 based devices will be extremely excited because today Sarik, the creator of Winterboard, Cydia, and Cydia Substrate, has released Winterboard 0.9.3912. For again, support with A7 and iOS 7 powered devices. In order to get Winterboard, it's extremely easy. Just open up Cydia, go to the changes section at the bottom, refresh up in the top left hand corner if you haven't done so in a while, and you should see a Cydia substrate update. Now this update is 0.9.5001. Install this update and then simply go to the search tab at the bottom and search for Winterboard. Once you've searched for Winterboard, the top result should be the official Winterboard Cydia tweak. And then from there, you'll just have to hit install followed by confirm in the top right hand corner. Once you've done that, you will have Winterboard. Now I've taken the liberty of installing Winterboard on my iPhone 5S here. As you can tell from the icons, I already have a theme set. This is actually my favorite free theme available inside of Cydia right now for iOS 7 devices. So let me show you what it is. I'm going to open up Winterboard and go to Select Themes. It's Flat 7. You can find it inside of City again just by searching for Flat 7 Theme. Between Flat and 7, there aren't any spaces, so it's just F-L-A-T 7 space theme, and you'll be able to find it in Winterboard there. Again, it is a free theme, and you get three things with it. You get the flat seven hex, the flat seven round, and the flat seven icons. So what the hex and the round do is they actually change the dimensions and also the shape of your icons. And in order to show you that, all you have to do is just check it. So I'm going to do the round option, press the home button, and once I go to the home screen, the device will instantly respring and the theme changes should apply. So I'm going to wait for my iPhone 5S to come back up here after the respring, and I'm going to simply unlock it. All right, there we go. And as you can see now, my icons are round instead of the traditional icon shape. Now, of course, there are tons of different themes you can get. And with this latest update, we should start to see more themes available inside of Cydia soon. So if you guys are a fan of themes and if you guys want to see me create more videos on themes, just be sure to rate this video up and leave a comment down below in the comment section letting me know that. Now I'm going to turn this theme off just to show you guys again what iOS looks like stock if for some reason you forgot. So I'm going to uncheck all of the options here, simply go to the home screen again and it will refresh and I'm going to wait for my iPhone 5S to come back up. All right, there we go. And as you can see, we are back to stock now. So that is my favorite theme, Flat 7. It is free, you can get it inside of Cydia now, along with the latest Winterboard update and the latest Mobile Substrate update. So just be sure to check it out inside of Cydia. All you have to do is just open it up, again, refresh, and you can search for it and find the latest Winterboard update. And on a side note, if you happen to see anything demonstrated in this video that I didn't go over, it's more than likely detailed in my top Cydia tweaks video. So just be sure to check that out. I'll have an annotation on the screen. Now, if you're on the desktop version of YouTube, you can find it just by clicking that. Otherwise, it's available on my channel. All right, and to conclude, of course, just be sure to rate this video up and leave a relevant comment in the comment section. If you want a chance to enter to win $100 Amazon gift card, once your comment's been posted, you'll be automatically entered to win. And if you guys wanna be updated more often, such as when I release new videos, whether they're related to jailbreaking or not, just be sure to like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. And until next time, this is ICU. Signing out.